Okay, I decided to do one more video, a uh, short one, uh, just to show you everything, all the exploded views with measurements. So here we go, I'm going to try to make this quick, so you guys can uh, get to your work and start fabricating this. Uh, this is the bearing support bracket. Let me zoom in so you can see all the measurements. 10 mm hole, 8 mm hole. The centers are 2.4 centimeters apart. The length of the bracket is 4.5 cm. This is where it gets welded. The oval hole is 8 mm wide. And here are the distances that you can see. Okay, so that's that. Let's go to the green bracket. Okay. Uh, three 8 mm holes, one here, one here, one here. Uh, this one and this one are the centers are 1.5 cm off the base here. Um, five centimeters long. This one is 2.6 centimeters wide. And this one is. 3.2 centimeters wide or long they're both 2.5 centimeters wide everything actually is 2.5 cm and here's another 8 mm hole okay that's that on to the guide uh, it's a 6 millimeter diameter hole for this bolt here and the center of it is 1.3 cm off the bottom of the flat bar here as you see 1.3 cm and it's 5 cm long and 33 cm long the square pipe and this notch I won't give you measurements because depending on where your blade is going to end depending again on your the type of jigsaw you use uh, you can cut this out by yourself very easy We'll figure it out, no problem. Um, on to the frame. Again, these measurements here for the flat bars, they depend on your uh, jigsaw. Uh, more than likely, they will be very close to this. If you use Makita, uh, the 4247 model, or the one I mentioned in the instructions PDF, uh, these measurements will apply exactly. Okay, one thing I want to mention here is this support arm, I mentioned 8.5 centimeters, but that's from this end here, and this bar gets attached here, so it will be, when you assemble it, it will look like this, and the distance will be 11, from there it will be 11, okay? And that's that. Hope this is very clear. And this notch also is five centimeters wide, but um, again depends on your jigsaw. And here we are with the sheet metal. This hole depends on your jigsaw, and then the measurements are as this.